Hi, welcome to another episode of Make Thrift Buy. This is the show where you, the audience, send me clothes or accessories that you found on the internet and then I do my best to recreate them. Today's challenge was suggested by Madoko and Marilyn, who both challenged me to try and make some pom-pom earrings. Now you can find fluffy earrings all over the internet from wholesale websites to handmade Etsy sellers and even in high-end fashion stores. I found these particular earrings on Shopbop. Yes, that's the actual price. They're made from rabbit fur and are gold-plated. Who has $300 to spend on fluffy earrings? Anyway, I thought that I could not only recreate these for a hell of a lot cheaper than even the wholesale ones, but also that they'd be pretty fun to try and recreate. So let's begin. For this project, I needed pom-poms. These were acrylic polyester pom-poms and not made out of rabbit fur, some scissors and pliers, a needle and thread, and some jump rings and earring hooks or earring clips. And all of these I was just able to find at my local craft stores. So the first thing that I did was to attach my jump rings to the earring hooks. To do this, I opened up the jump ring using a pair of pliers, put it onto the loop at the bottom of the earring hook, and then using the pliers, closed up the jump ring. Then I threaded my needle with some thread in a light color. I doubled the thread over, and then I tied a couple of knots in the end to make one big knot. Then I paired off my pom-poms into matching pairs and I chose the pair I wanted to make earrings out of. Now these type of pom-poms have this hard, dense center and that's where you want the needle to go through. With my needle, I pushed it right through the center of the pom-pom and out the other side, making sure that the thread was secure. Then I inserted the needle just next to the spot where it came out before and went right back through the middle to the other side. Then I threaded the earring hook on by putting my needle through the jump ring and then pushing the needle back down through the middle of the pom-pom. Then I secured the pom-pom to the earring hook by going up and down and up and down through the pom-pom a couple more times and looping the thread through the jump ring each time I went back up. After doing that and bringing my thread back down to the bottom of the earring, I tied a knot a couple of times in the thread and then I cut the excess thread off. And then I just repeated this to give myself two earrings. I also wanted to make this longer dangly type of earring. So I had this old broken necklace that I pulled apart to use as the chain. I just cut the chain with some scissors, which is probably not all that good for the scissors, but I didn't have any cutting pliers. So I cut two pieces of chain to the same length, which is about two to three inches. And then I just attached the jump rings to one end and the earring hooks to the other end like this. And then I sewed the jump rings onto the pom-poms in exactly the same way as for the other earrings. By going up and down through the middle of the pom-pom and looping the thread through the jump ring in order to secure the chain and the earring hook to the pom-pom. Also, oh my gosh, I found these glow-in-the-dark pom-poms at the craft store, so as if I wasn't going to try and make earrings out of these. So, that was it. That's how I made pom-pom earrings. So, how did I go? So my conclusion is, obviously. Each pair costs under a dollar to make. They make really cute gifts. They'd be really fun to make with friends and a craftinoon. You don't really need any kind of crafting skills except knowing how to thread a needle and using a pair of pliers to open up a bit of wire. So instead of buying these, I definitely recommend that you make them for yourself. And if you do, tag me on Instagram using the hashtag DIYAnnika because I'd love to see how you go. That applies for this project and any of my other tutorials. And I hope you're all having a really good day and I'll see you for my next video. Bye!